You put it in the newspaper. At least once a month, I will come back to this district and I will have a town hall meeting similar to this right here, where I face the voters, regardless of whether or not you're Republican, Democrat, conservative, liberal, because if I'm gonna be your leader, I need to be able to look you in the eye and explain why I did what I did and hear what you got to say about it. Right now, we don't have that at all. We don't have that period in the political structure market. Okay? Now, a lot of those predecessors, Jim Taylor was very good about that. He came out and he talked to people all the time. So I asked around, I went to Washington DC and I talked to some congressmen up there that I know and I asked them, am I promising too much? And they looked at me and shook their head and they were like, no. <laughs> I mean, that's what we all do. And I was like, really? Well, it's not happening in the fourth district. That's when they tell me they weren't surprised. Um, Benny Thompson, over in the second district, I think it is. Uh, Benny was telling me, I sat down and had dinner with him. And uh, Benny comes home every weekend, every single weekend. And he talks, meets with people, at least. And, you know, he didn't come home and do it like he, he takes a break. But he comes home and says, I'm going to go meet with folks at least one place, one time, while I'm home every weekend. Well, guess what Benny never really has to do? He's never had to do a campaign. Why? Because he's already out there meeting folks. He's already out there face to face. He's already out there talking to them, and he knows, and they know him. And I mean, I got news for you. It makes all the difference. But instead, we've got our guy now that I think he's going to start coming out a little bit. I think he's a little worried. <laughs> but, uh, so I'll be down here once, once a month, no matter what. Okay? Here's the next thing. Two things about if you call my office. Number one, within two working days, 48 hours, two working days, if you call that office, somebody from my staff will call you back. Period. If they don't, I promise you they won't work there very long. That doesn't mean I'm going to have a solution for you in two days, but they're going to call back and say, hey, look, we're working on it. We owe you a call back at a da 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 set time. It's that simple. Why? We work for you. We work for you. It's that simple. Now, there's a, there's three exceptions to what I just told you. And that is, I'm in that, in that case, you notice I said staffer, a minimum staffer, right? Because I mean, get get hundreds of calls a day at the congressman's office. But if you are a veteran issue, if you are a senior citizen issue, or you are a child. My staffer will make sure that I am ready that day. I don't want to wait. I want to know about it. And then I want to know when it's rectified. Why? Veterans have already paid the price. They've already given up every God given.